<laughs> That's a different entry for me. I um, this knee until my knee is better. Um, welcome to Belinda's Book Nook, and this is my Vlogmas. Um, I am not making sure. I'm making sure. I'm learning as I go not to say what day it is when I record these because they may come out in different order. Um, but um, I'm having fun doing it. It's just a little stressful when I'm rendering the video and editing it because this isn't, you know, um, back in my history, I did do some of that kind of work, um, but that was a long, long time ago with different technology. So I am still learning how to do to do what I'm doing and although it may not seem like much that you're seeing there is a little bit of um work that is behind these so I you know hats off to all the people that do these ma marvelous videos that I see for vlogmas and in general vlogs um they are quite a production and I'm kind of glad that it's December because December I just told you all I'm not going to do any reading of books I, I shouldn't say that I'm not going to have a TBR I will be always reading because there's always something that catches my eye or you know, I love to pick up um, cozies and romance during um, the December month. So I probably will listen to some audiobooks and things like that. But there's nothing in the, you know, I'm not really cranking like I try to during the regular year. So December is kind of a good month to try to figure this out. And I think once I learn what I need to know, um, I've already learned a, quite a bit um, just through a couple of videos that it will make it easier for me to do it in the future. And so hopefully this will lead to me doing vlogs um, throughout the year um, a little bit more um, frequent and um, with a little bit more pizzazz. So today's video is going to be my um, setting up of my craft room um, display roll. Um, it's just a place where I sometimes I put just photos. Sometimes I'm just like in the, you know, in the memory mode and I'll have family photos, especially if we've just come back from a vacation, um, things like that. Sometimes it's my own artwork. Sometimes it's things that are inspiring me. So every time I come in the office, I can kind of look at these things to kind of remind me what, um, what I'm thinking or what I'm trying to work on for inspiration. Um, and other times I've, you know, I've, I think probably, hmm, maybe about six years or so I've been using it to do the seasons because my mom was really a big advocate um, and uh, she just went all out and decorated our house for all of the seasons, like all of the seasons, all of the holidays, you know, we had Easter bunnies and, you know, every holiday she had something. So in our house we knew, and she was also a school teacher. So school teachers kind of lend themselves to that because they're doing it in school. So she would, you know, um, maybe it was Valentine's Day and then she'd wear like little heart earrings to school for the kids to see. And so it translated to her personality and also to the stuff that we would have around the house. So I kind of like that. And even though my kids are older, I still like it. I like the signaling of different times. And so I am going to walk you through changing mine from autumn to winter um, and slash Christmas. And I will probably leave this up a good portion of winter till we get to Valentine's Day well, when I will change it up. And hopefully I'll do another video so you can see that. But I just wanted to come in and, and say something before I just slap all of a sudden we're in there and I'm doing that. So I hope you enjoy the video and let me know. And thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate comments and I appreciate all of the um, encouragement because I was really nervous about doing this. So I will see you guys soon in my craft room. Bye. Hey everybody, let's decorate. This is my display wall in my craft room that I like to put artwork up. Um, and I've, for years now, I like to decorate it for the seasons. So I want to get rid of autumn and put my winter stuff up and get it ready for Christmas. So let's do it together. Um, I just, you know, I have these, this banner that I made. Um, I probably should have brought a stool. I um, bought this banner. I bought a banner and then I made this one, um, copying the one that I got from Target. Just using my own craft supplies and some stickers. 
um, and my silhouette machine for autumn. I was going to do on the reverse winter and still may do that next year, but I think just for a change, I'm going to go with lights instead. So we're going to put the stuff that I got when we went to um, Target and some of the stuff that I used from last year. So without further ado, let's get started. So I have, oh, one thing I love is this that I put, and she's so sweet. Um, I put her over here and hang that up there. And then I'll do, you know, put it in the days that we were at or whatever to catch track the days. And then the rest of it is just putting up different um, things. Like I have big ones that I got from Target that I like to put like that. We'll take these other things down too. My bats, I hang little bats for Halloween. These little wooden cars I absolutely love. They're from my mom. So I like putting them up. Keepsakes come up here, end up on here. Photos end up on that wall. Lots of things. So. Why don't you do that? So I'm going to think while I try to put the stuff up. And instead of listening to me talk, I'm going to put some music on so you can listen to music while I do this. <laughs> 